Paul Humiller, Dream Guitars, and I absolutely adore Doncho Ivanov as a man and as a guitar maker. And this is the why, this kind of instrument that he can build that's so inspirational and so beautiful and elegant at all at the same time. He's, he's a true artist in my mind. Um, OM body shape, um, no big surprise there, but then you start to look closely and you see all the little details that he does that are really his own sort of style, which I just, I personally adore. The bridge shape is awesome, and if you look close at the pictures, you'll see the relief carvings here. This happens to be an Indian rosewood bridge. Um, the rosette has this beautiful sort of bird's foot pattern, and then these red subtle lines which are echoed out in the purflings and all along the fingerboard. So I like red on a guitar. I think it can be very classy and unique and a little bit um, have just a touch of attitude, which I, I like as well. Um, the continuation of the fingerboard over the sound hole, just really lovely and again adds to the overall sort of what I call elegance or beauty of the guitar. The headstock, again, he does a beautiful um, relief um, carving on the head plate. This one's Zero Cote. Just gives it a touch of class that, you know, um, you don't always get on an instrument. I'm going to stop halfway back and just show you these bindings. This is lace wood surrounding beautiful fiddleback mahogany. Give you the money shot there. That's just a gorgeous set of wood. I just really love Fiddleback Mahogany. And of course it has that beautiful, clear, dry, punchy sort of voice, which um, this one just sounds great to me. And then again, he used lace wood for this dramatic multi-piece backstrip, which is really hard to do. If you imagine all of those angles and beautiful fine lines between the lace wood, a lot of detail work there. And for Tancho, I think it's just like, it's like having breakfast. He can do that kind of stuff in his sleep. He's just such a, such a, a craftsman and artisan. Um, a beautiful European maple neck as well. And the top is not to be um, glossed over here because it's Swiss Alpine um, Moon Spruce. And Moon Spruce, as you've heard me say many times, is one of my favorites because it's harvested when the sap goes to the bottom of the tree. So there's less resin, so the wood is lighter and more vibrant. I personally have two guitars made with that as my top wood of choice, and I just love them. They're just two of my favorite instruments. Um, I play them all the time. So Moon Spruce, um, something very special and very expensive and hard to get as well. So it adds to the value of this guitar. So there's a lot of little ingredients that make a great guitar. And this is certainly one from Doncho Ivanov, and I'm looking forward to playing it for you. Today I'm in standard tuning with a new piece I created in A minor. Hope you enjoy it. Mm -hmm. 